becoming a Christian and being a Christian are two different things. Some people think that I become a Christian by being a Christian. So you just find out what the Bible says, how we should live, and then you start doing those things. And as you start doing those things, then you become a Christian. Or they would say, you know, like, I think if I can, you know, I'm going to stand before God and he's going to put my good over here and my bad over here. And if my good outweighs my bad, I'm in. If my bad outweighs my good, I'm out. So therefore, I need to just make sure that, you know, like, that I'm, I'm trying to get rid of the bad and I'm trying to pile up the good. But that's not what, that's not what helps you to become a Christian. To become a Christian is to understand this body of truth, this I'm a sinner, Jesus came to save me, he's sinless, God poured out his, my wrath upon him, God treated, it's like I was the one who offended God, and God made the apology. Where else do you, that's, the, the, the song, the, the hymn writer said, it's amazing grace. I offended God. God understands the apology that I need to make, I could not make because he's God and my righteousness is as filthy rags and I'm not good enough to make an appropriate enough uh, uh, an apology and all of my glory is going to fall short, Romans says. And so God, I offended God with my sin and God says, but I know you can't make an adequate apology, so I'm going to apologize for you. Here's Jesus, my son, as an, as an apology for your sin, would you please accept this gift? And the action that he asks of you is not church, it's not a travel to a, a sacred site, it's not to give an amount of money, it's no acts of service, it is to believe to place your faith upon him, how would you activate that? The scripture te teaches us, whosoever shall call upon the name of the Lord shall be saved. It doesn't have to be a specific set of words. As long as you understand that you cannot save yourself and that God sent his son to save you, but if I was leading somebody in a prayer to begin a relationship with Jesus, this would be the prayer. Heavenly Father, I admit I am a sinner in need of a Savior. I recognize I cannot save myself. That's repenting from dead works. I cannot save myself. And you can even add in there, I cannot even help myself get saved. I can't even add to it, right? I am here. I cannot go one inch there. Jesus had to come all the way to me. I cannot save myself. I accept your gift of grace through Jesus alone. I place all my trust for my soul salvation and what Jesus Christ has done for me.